right, I'm Tracy T. Love here again with some really cool people. Hi, what's your name? Hi, Kena Ferguson. Fred Thomas Jr. Kena Ferguson. Yes, she's so beautiful. Look at you guys. So what brings you here tonight? We have a film in the film festival called Kai, and um, I wrote and starred in it, and Fred here directed it. Let, let me just say, you are the hardest working woman. <laughs> you are the hardest working <laughs> Host and media, right? Yo, this is crazy. You were still interviewing. The cameraman went to the bathroom, <laughs> and she was still. He was like, "I got a pee. I got the." So I just wanted you to know. I just, hey, now see, that's the way I do it. I give everybody their fair share because I really want to see what your product making. If it's good, I'm all for it, and we want everybody to know about it. Thank you, thank you. Well, talk about the film. Yes. Uh, so Kai is a film. It's about a girl that has a very um, strange addiction. And it's kind of a satire. And uh, we shot it last year. Um, took us like only a couple days, it's a short. And uh, Fred came in and he took the vision that I had, that I wrote, and really just sculpted it and made it everything that I wanted it to be. And I'm very, very pleased and happy with it. It's been doing really well. Did you like have to beat him up a little bit? <laughs> you know what? I thought I was gonna have to. I thought I was gonna have to when I was prepared. Okay. Yeah, yeah. But luckily he did well okay. and I didn't have to. And you know what, and, and, and we were friends, so that kinda helped. Yeah. So we kinda we 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 know kinda each other's temperament and and we were in sync anyway, you know. We yeah. worked on a bunch of projects so we kinda know. It, 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 exactly, 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 you know what I'm saying? But it was good though, yeah, it, it worked, it definitely worked. We shot it in two days, um, and pre-production took us a couple of months, you know, just trying to get everything together. But the writing for you? The writing for me, I was able to write the outline in like a, like a couple days, but rewriting and structuring it took a couple of months, just to get it right exactly. And then Fred came in and really helped me kind of punch up some things and figure out the, the smaller things, which was good. There we go. Yes, you yes, will. Yes, yes, And it's definitely worth saying. It's yeah. very, yeah. very good. I know you can't give me everything. <laughs> I've been trying to get the whole movie out of everyone, but no one will give me everything. Only thing I can say is that it's about a young woman who's on the verge of what we call lifestyle suicide. She's so into being in the lifestyle. Um, and you'll get a kick out of it. It's something yeah. everybody can relate to. Everybody can relate to. Everybody's yeah. gonna be like, oh yeah, I know that. A comedy, a drama, a comedy. Dark comedy. Dark comedy. Yeah, dark comedy. Yeah. So is this girl like a designer, like crazy girl? <laughs> no, she's just a regular. She's like everybody yeah. else. You'll you'll be like, oh, that's just me, and then you'll be like, oh. <laughs> the fact that we're saying that she's female is giving too much away. Okay. Right. Thank you. Okay. Right now, we are at the Wilshire, Wilshire, Theater. Wilshire, Theater. Wilshire Theater. The Wilshire Theater having a crazy, lovely party right now. Right. And we're going to do some more. You want to drink with us and yeah, hang with us? And, with okay, cool. Can you break like, away? Can you break away? Yeah, I need to. Okay. I mean, take me. I mean, kidnap me. She's, she's dancing. She's dancing. Bye. She's dancing. Fred Thomas Jr. Giving you a shout out to Rushing for Life TV. Because there was it. Ah!